In the U.S. singles final at Forest Hills, New York, Louise Bruff meets 30-year-old Althea Gibson at the near end, who proves she's still in the brilliant form which won her this year's Wimbledon title. First set goes to Althea 6-3, and here she is polishing off the second set even faster. Just watch that action. Set point for Althea, Louise serving. And that's it. Althea Gibson becomes the first of her race to win the American singles crown. A double record, for she was the first at Wimbledon too. Next, the men's singles, Malcolm Anderson and Ashley Cooper. Once again, it's an all-Australian final. Cooper serves. He's seeded number one, so it's natural for him to be here, but Mel Anderson's a surprise. He wasn't even on the seeded list. But it's an even bigger surprise when he outplays the great Cooper. Anderson serves for match point. And Cooper's beaten. Never before has the singles title been won by an unseeded player. Vice President Nixon hands the trophies to Althea Gibson and Mel Anderson, congratulating them on their achievements. And the crowd adds its own applause for two first-timers who have made tennis history. <laughs>